Take a look at the kind of stocks, by the way, uh, which are uh, sort of uh, which uh, are doing well, which in the broader space, right? Uh, and uh, I'm not kind of saying this w one way or the other, but so it's it's a mix of uh, sugar. So a long list of sugar stocks, and let's pull these up: Renuka, uh, big mover; Dhampur, big mover; Uttam Sugar, Dalmia, Mavana, Ugar Sugar. I can go on with this list: Avad Sugar, Dwarikesh. So. You got about 12, 14 sugar stocks all rallied. If you can have these up, please. There you go. I think uh, we've got one. Uh, Uttam. Let's have uh, the others also. There's Mavana, there's uh, uh, Renuka, uh, there's uh, Dwarikesh, Dhampur, etc. Then you come to the fertilizer stocks. Fact. Names like RCF, Madras Fertilizers. So there is sugar, uh, there is fertilizer, uh, which, is, uh, which, which did very well in the broader markets. Uh, and then you get to paper, you know, so uh, JK paper, Andhra paper, Tamil Nadu paper, Orient paper. Uh, these are the names uh, which participated. And then there are there is rice, Dawat, KRBL are some of the names which participated. So it's a curious mix, right? I mean, uh, and these are sectors where it's never one stock. It's, uh, you know, these spaces are small in size. If you take consider the total listed market cap of each of these uh, sort of sectors together, and they move together. Uh, so sugar, you know, some of these rice stocks, fertilizer, paper. That's basically what did the best in the broader market. Uh, and I looked at the top 40 odd uh, movers, volume-led movers, and these were these four sectors. You also had some EMS companies which did well, uh, so which we highlighted, of course. We highlighted Sirma, but uh, the other one was Avalon, uh, which was a big mover. Uh, so yesterday we had highlighted that note from Jefferies, which uh, talked about that I think they were initiating coverage in that sector. So Sirma, Avalon, etc. participating very well. Rail stocks on the other side though. I mean, uh, we've been highlighting uh, the move in these names. Uh, so IRFC, RVNL and IRCON. Actually, there's Titagar and Texmaco as well. All were down between 2 and 5 to 6 percent uh, in uh, trade today. So yeah, I mean, the broader market... Uh, you know, all did also recover, like the Nifty and the Bank Nifty. But just take a look at uh, and be watchful of the kind of stuff which uh, moved today. Rima. Well, at the index level, it's a solid comeback. The Nifty low today was 19,491, which means below 19,500, and we're going to be ending above 19,600. So it's a good 100 point plus recovery from the day's low, and all of it took place. Most of it took place in the last one hour. Uh, the pockets of strength, one is uh, consumer, FMCG. Satara Consumer is the top nifty gainer as rumors resurface about the company looking to buy stake in Haldi Rams, a majority stake of 51%. The stock ends with a gain of about 4.5%, very large volumes. But other consumer names like Britannia, Titan, ITC, uh, seen some very smart up moves. Uh, pharma has had a very good session. There was a defensive tilt in the markets from the beginning of trade, but Torrent Pharma was the top gainer. Nomura upgraded this, not upgraded, they raised the target price to 2,199. They believe if they go through with the acquisition of Cipla, it will be a strategic fit. Divi's Laboratory, Cipla, Lupin gaining in trade. Other notable movers include Bharti Airtel. So it wasn't just Vodafone Idea and Industars. The entire telecom basket saw some buying. And HDFC Bank was one of those lone banks standing in the grain while the rest of the pack struggled. At least the large cap names like Axis Bank, Indusind Bank, ICICI Bank. These three banks ended in the red while HDFC Bank stood pretty tall and some correction in Tata Steel, Hindalco after the rally that we had earlier in the week. The bell has gone and the Nifty has ended above 19,600. A solid comeback and closing in the green for the fourth consecutive session now for the Nifty and the Sensex. The mid-cap, small caps recovered but largely ending flat. Well, with that, it's a wrap and closing bell from the entire team. Thank you for watching. Don't go anywhere. A special offering. CNBC TV 18 Weekender comes up next.